Welcome back to Let's Play Crisis 2. I'm Burning Dog Face. And I'd like to start the second session of a Let's Play by showing you guys exactly what happens when I load the game. Because until I've done it once, you can never really be sure. Will it throw me in at the very beginning of the level? Will I be standing exactly where I was? Let's find out. It is always faster to switch to your sidearm than to reload your current weapon. It's very helpful to know before I threw my Nova away. I'm just saying. Prophet gave it to me and everything. I appear to be at the beginning of the subway area. Oh, that guy was beeping. Uh, Prophet, maybe the subway wasn't the best idea. I'm reading dozens of heat signatures right underneath you. Watch your step down there. Hmm. Oh shit, oh shit! Get off me! Get the fuck off me! Ah! Jesus. Okay, now you're dead. And it has just occurred to me that this is the last room in the world where you want to be standing in ankle-deep water, so let's get the fuck out of here. I showed this screenshot to a friend of mine, by the way, the, uh, the TV thing here. And the... Yeah, he suggested that the most likely explanation behind all these shows that ended more than a decade ago is that they just grabbed a real section of a TV guide from 2011 and uh, didn't think too hard about it. This was 2011? I hadn't even heard the phrase, speak truth to power, in 2011. How'd they nail that? Interesting. <laughs> Sorry about that. I just wanted to get a note, because uh, there are a whole bunch of comments on here. And uh, I really appreciate that. You guys seem really enthusiastic. Such as Derek Floyd, who has a great enthusiasm for sharing details of weaponry, both fictional and real, with us. Such as, the Scarab is the carbine version of the Superior Combat Assault Rifle, the standard service rifle of the U.S. Marine Corps and Army Special Forces in the Crisis-verse. Uh, the platform takes design cues in the HK XM8 and the Remington ACR. It's manufactured by Scrutch Industries and is chambered for 4mm Scar Sabot, down from the full caliber 6.8x43mm it uses in Crisis 1. The smaller cartridges mean more bullets per mag, 40 in this case. The Scarab is differentiated from the Scar by its flat top receiver, redesigned handguard, and folding stock. And there was another one in here. About the, uh. What is it called? The feline. Ah, here it is. Actually, this is a longer comment. Tour guide hat on! You started in Battery Park, on the south end of Manhattan. The castle is Castle Clinton, an early 19th century immigration station. You came out of the park onto the corner of State and Bridge Street. The building to your left, north, is the National Museum of the American Indian, and to your right is one Battery Park Plaza. If you continue north, you will find the famous Charging Bull bronze statue to the right and Bowling Green Station to the left. Shooting hat on! The feline visually resembles the French Famas Valeries, crossed with the British L-22A1. 
In universe, the Lankin Linder Feline SMG was introduced in 2019 for law enforcement and specialist military application, and is considered one of the best of its class. It fires the 4.7mm compact pistol cartridge at a colossal 1,200 rounds per minute on full auto. Damn. The closest real cartridge I could find is the 4.6x30mm that the H&K developed for their MP7 platform. And there is a reason why Alcatraz won't speak. A couple of people left comments suggesting that there is a reason that I'm a silent protagonist outside of tequila hangovers. And that's strangely ominous to me. Oh yes, and it finally occurred to me, by the way. Uh, just for the record. I have a tendency to stand on top of things and look down at groups of extremely well-trained soldiers who really don't stand a chance against me. I can turn invisible at will. Uh, actually engaging me reveals that I'm practically bulletproof. And I have infrared vision. I'm the fucking predator! Interesting, you can combine nano vision with the cloak. I don't think you can combine the cloak and the, uh, the armor. Let me check that. Correct. I guess it's, uh, two different things to do with the surface of the suit. You know, I had forgotten until I went back to check when my, uh, original Crisis series was that, uh, and it was, uh, the, 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 the developer logo for Crytek in the first game had the voice of the suit guy going, Maximum Game. It really appeals to the part of my brain that's nostalgic for the 90s. <laughs> yes, let's go save the city and have time for burn notice. I didn't realize the map of the city was that accurate. I guess it is one of the most famous cities in the world, in fairness. Oh, use phone. We're sorry. Your call cannot be completed as dialed. Please hang up and try your call again. I just went backwards. My bad! No, not X. Uh, B. B to power slide when you're running. It's the duck button. Baffing around far too long, so let's uh. Die, you slimy bastard! Ah! That's a good sign. Yes, that's right. We were right here. Shit! Alien target! Take it down! It's a nest! Get out of there, Prophet! Find an alternate route. Close encounters, 5 out of 25. Be. Some African jungle shit. I'm all over something. They've been spraying from the plane. Look at me, man. Look at me! Jesus. Where are these things coming from? They looked like machines when I killed them. Oh, not falling back down there. Oh, uh, I suppose I had a comment with the pistol as well, but standing around for far too long, so we can get to that later. Also, had a really nice comment to read. Oh, oh! Oh, the Indiana Jones thing! I travel from here to here. Suspicion of infection. Further to this, nano 
biosuit subject, Prophet, is also designated as an active biohazard. Prophet is to be shot on sight. Fuck. I had a feeling that Lockhart guy I heard name dropped earlier would be a son of a bitch, but, you know, I wanted to give him the shadow of a doubt. Shit. Oversight 1, he's breaking low. Got him right on my nose. Roger that, stay on him. Bring him down. Find a route to Nathan Gould. I was to pause my videos. Wait, why would a test pattern be on a, uh, on a fucking computer monitor? It should just be light lit up and blank if there's no signal. It's not, it's not a TV. Oh, this guy blew his own head off. Oh, nasty. Marshall, huh? I do love a good shotgun. It could lead a cheerier use than ending the life of a desperate man. No! What the hell? The fuck has that kind of firepower? I didn't even hear a chopper or anything. Wait, it just says ice. Is it a can of cold water? Oh, I remember this. This is in the uh, the intro video. He grabbed a guy by the throat and threw him out the window. Oh, God! I don't remember this. Dude is rebooting? Are you kidding me? Lighting him up. Target lock. Missile away. Confirmed missile hit. He's going in hard. Oh, I'm hearing that, right. Oh. Oversight six and seven, I have your kill confirmed. Hold station. We're coming in. Profit! You see that? You see that? Must have gone down less than a block from where you are. You do realize what this means, right? This is our chance. This is it. Forget extraction. We have to jump on this. Go get samples from the crash. Get them to me here at the lab. Yeah. This could be our best shot at rolling back the spore. May maybe the whole invasion even. But you'd better make it fast. Lockhart's going to have cells swarming all over that crash site in nothing flat. Watch your ass, Prophet. Reach the crash site and obtain Xeno tissue extract for gold. Oh, man. That's some heavy shit. I don't know what to make of that. Uh, shout out to, uh, Justin Jones, who, uh... You left a comment saying, uh... First, I want to say I'm glad to be able to post comments again. I was having screen reader difficulties, so I couldn't leave comments on your videos as far back as your God of War Let's Play. And I wanted to make so many observations and awful puns. I appreciate that. Uh... In any instance, I'll be having a vicarious experience of playing this game through your Let's Play. I don't know if you remember that I am that totally blind guy that commented on that fact during your Doom 2016 playthrough. Given your narrative skills, I feel like I will have a better understanding of what is going on in the game. Uh, anyway, I guess that Crisis 2 is merely substituting one jungle for another. Oh, I didn't say. For the record, I totally do remember you. That's not something you forget easily. Say hi to Kelly for me. Uh, yes, uh, also, I find that this game is prophetic. I am not sorry for that wordplay about the outbreak of a deadly disease. 
Also, did you catch the aliens reference that one of the marines made during the bullshitting on the sub? I did not, in fact, catch that. So I'm glad people are paying attention. Oh. Why am I walking around with a shotgun? Okay. Why do I need to be invisible? Let's get up top and cover their approach. All right, let's move. Or you could do nothing and I could kill you. I'm just saying it's an option. Oh, Are you kidding me? I'm behind this. Where the fuck? Where the? Is that guy even alive? I guess so. No longer alive. That's you. You have unsubscribed from life. Do you copy? Give me my energy. Huh? Ah! It's called the Reaper. That's who you saw. Oh, I see. It could have gone around. My bad. No, no. I see a red dot on the radar. Oh, fuck. Shit. Oh, double shit. What are you guys doing over here? What? Oh shit! I just keep walking into more of these guys. No, you don't. You imagined it. Fuck you and the horse you rode in on, buddy. Oh, yeah, kick the car. Let's not do that. Oh, jeez. The guy was a beautiful child once. He had hopes and dreams of the future, and now he's fucking roach food. Because of his goddamn Seth. them and blow up that barrel, but fuck it. They are much better at seeing me than the North Koreans were, I will give you that. They must have been working with Prophet before the shit hit the fan. There is some weird shit going down in this city, and those jackboot assholes on the corner with their little cell huh. logo and their PMC paychecks That's weird. signed off by taxpayers like you and me are not here to help. They're here to put that jackboot in. This ain't America anymore. This hmm. is the United States and knuckle under like the man says, or else. This is Radio Freeman. Could use more uh, shotgun ammo. Now that I can see there's shotguns in the ground down here. Uh, there. Tell no one, but he didn't like that. Jesus! I am tough! Aha! Ooh, that's not great. Oh yeah, look at that, the shotgun only has one firing mode. I actually remember playing a game that had firing modes that had more than one setting for the shotgun, but it was about how choked it is, whether it's a 
really, really devastating blasts that'll only hit the guy directly in front of you, or a widespread blast that'll pepper everyone standing in front of you with uh, just a little bit of damage. Or, you know, you could set it to the second thing and shove it up a guy's ass and absolutely obliterate him. I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> that sounds disgusting. What? Strange. Sorry about that. Let me make it up to you by giving a shout out to F. Drake, who uh, left a comment saying, Hey, BDF, just a tip I heard. The current objective is always visible from the tactical visor. Hey, thanks. It seems it's going to be a really good tip. You'd think they'd have told me that. Uh. Exchange Scarab for Stealth Scarab? Fuck yeah. It's got a giant... Uh, back. Oh, I see. Under barrel extended clip or light shotgun. Oh, and I can change from laser uh, from iron sight to laser sight. I don't know if they can see that though, so I'm gonna go ahead and change it to iron sight for now. Oh, there's dudes out there. Setting checkpoints every two blocks. How many blocks are in this uh, city? I would guess a lot. Shutters, okay. Fair enough. Jesus! Zoom with the other one? I don't fucking know. Oh yeah, give us a second. So we can use my hands. No. No, it's just in there. Fine. Manhattan Informer. I don't know that. Oh! I don't even know what he did! Somebody must have a rocket launcher. Shit. Let me see if I can get that key. The timer just went. Do you get better zoom with this? I don't know. Oh, I can't put it on single shot mode. That's weird. And now I have a reflex sight. When did that happen? Seriously, when did that happen? 
Well, the timer has gone. So, uh... I'll have to call it here. Come on, I know there's a motherfucker on the roof. is. Ah, well. I'm Burning Dogface, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Crisis 2, when we engage with those assholes and make them regret keeping an eye out. Later!